आप रिकॉर्ड हो गया हेलो गाइस इन दिस डेमो क्लास आई विल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग अबाउट द लैश लैश इज अ सॉफ्टवेयर यूज फॉर वेब एनिमेशन एंड एज वेल एज यू कैन यूज एज अ प्रोग्रामिंग सॉफ्टवेयर ऑल्सो एंड यू कैन डू लॉट लॉट्स ऑफ थिंग्स विथ लैश लैश सपोर्ट वेक्टर ग्राफिक्स सो दैट यू कैन ब्रिंग illustrator files inside that class and you can animate your uh, character even you can animate your text and you can animate the backgrounds and all those things you can see the flash banners on the header of the website and on the right side of the uh, side side bars and also in various application and games uh, people are using the flash application so i will be explaining the interface of the flash first of all we have to understand the interface of the flash so this is the main screen of the flash uh, here you can find the things like file edit commands and windows so first of all uh, we will create a new file which is called action script 3.0 Action Script 3.0 is the latest script of the Flash, uh, which we can use, uh, which we can use to create uh, complex games as well as websites and all those things. So, as this is the demo class, I will be only explain some tools of the Flash, and uh, I will explain how. Uh, the things we can animate in the flash so i will be start uh, with new file so as you can see i am going to take action script 3.0 so here if we i i take the new file and Uh, as you are beginner and this is the demo class i will explain the interface of this flash uh, application so this is called the canvas and the stage here we are going to animate the things as well as we can draw the things in this uh, stage uh, also uh, you can see these are the tools these are the tools we will use to create the things in the flash uh, here you can find the empty library in this library we can bring the uh, objects and we can bring the text as well as uh, we can bring the uh, images and uh, the 100% you can see that 100% it is the living uh, the living of this uh, stage size i will change that and you can see the effect as you can see if i take 200 the screen getting large screen getting zoom and if i take 50% or 25% it is getting it is getting very small because of the zoom so i will i will go to default 100% and let us see uh, the first tool this is called selection tool in the flash and uh, it is used to it is used to select the object on the stage i will start with small rectangle so that you can understand so i will i will take this rectangle and i will draw on this so as you can see okay we we was we were talking about the color of the objects and uh, i i shown you how to change the color of the rectangles now again i am showing you how i am changing the color using the uh, what we can say top color we can say that fill color let me zoom it to show you
This is where we are changing the color. As you can see, I zoomed it out. If you click on that color, you can change the color of the stitch. Here. Now, suppose if I want to cut this part from here, so that I will create the footer of the small website, uh, I will show you. I am selecting with the selection tool like this. As you can see, I selected like this and I am pressing the delete key on the keyboard. As you can see, it is cut it out from the bottom. Now, suppose if I want to take copy of this, I will drag it. I will hold Alt D on the keyboard. Or suppose I will create new footer from here. I am using this rectangle tool. As you can see, I am using this rectangle tool to create footer of the website, like I created the header of the website. I will click this. I will create from like this. If I want to again select this footer, I will again go to this tool selection. This is the selection tool. I will select this, I will select this. I will change it. Suppose if I want to take same color as I take on the top, like red color. If I want to refresh the color, I will use this. Eyedropper tool. I will zoom it out. This is the eyedropper. As you can see that eyedropper tool. The object footer is selected and I will just click on that uh, header to reference the color. As you can see, the color of the footer is changed. Now, this is uh, nothing but a small uh, website layout. And, uh, in between, I will create some small sort of animation. So, I will create some animation from here. This is our header, this is sidebar and this is footer. For your information, I will write text on that. I will take this tool. I am using, I am going to use the text tool. Text tool is used to write the text on the uh, stage or object. This is text tool. I will write header in here. And if I want to increase the text size, I will select it again like this. And I will go to Windows. And here you will find the properties. Again, I am showing you Windows. Where is properties? This is properties. This is you can see the flash will show the check mark uh, beside the properties. And control plus F3 is for shortcut for that. And from here you can find the option is size, you can see the text size here. Okay? And uh, I will increase the size. As you can see, the header is, header is red color. We will change the color. Here you can change the text color. Like this. 
I will do the same thing. This is sidebar. As you can see, this is sidebar, this is header, and I will write again. I have to take the move tool and click on the stage, and again I have to take the text tool. This is footer. If I want, if I want to move this text below, if I want to move this text, I am going. I am using the same tool. This is the tool, selection tool. This is the selection tool. And again, if I want to change the size of the footer, I will use same. I can change the size from here. I will take thirty percent. And again. I will move this. So this is the simple demonstration of Flash application. I created the small layout of the website, and also I shown you how the uh, move selection tool, rectangle tool, and this is uh, eye dropper tool. And I have shown this this one fill color, okay. And uh, now we have less time in demo class, so I will just show small animation using the timeline of the flash. If you click double click on this, if you click double click on the timeline, as you can see, you can get the timeline for animation. As you can see, this is the first layer, and let me explain you what is timeline first. This is the timeline. This is all the time. This is the timeline. Here you will find this is the keyframes. You know, this is the empty keyframes. And if I, if you see this black dot. This is black dot is used consider as a keyframe. This is empty keyframes. So we are working in first layer. Layer is also a vast concept in the flash. But uh, here you can see the layer one. In the layer one, you can find the black key dot. This is called keyframe. Inside that we have all this. If I hide this, you can see we we can. We cannot see anything if I hide this layer. You can see the height is here. This is how. This is how you can hide the layer. Now, suppose we are working in one layer. Every layer has its keyframes. In that keyframes, we are we create the animations. So. We will avoid this layer first, and I will create the layer for animation. I will create one layer using this. And I will see. As you can see, I created the layer. This is layer. As you can see, this is layer two. And inside that layer, I will create the animation. First, I will write the text. Uh, what I will create here? The text. Uh, this is my first website. Will uh, first thing it will be small and that. And it will be go big. So if 
first of all we have to select this e frame here and i will change the size of that uh, text using this Because of I take ten here, the text is got small. Okay. Now I will animate this. I will make this uh, text to appear as a bold, appear bold, or it will be uh, it will be zoom like this. I'm selecting the two uh, frames here. On 50, I'm selecting the two frames using the selection tool, and I will press F5 on my keyboard, or I will right right click on this, and I will select Insert Frames. As you can see, it, I selected the insert frames and those. Empty black keyframes become the uh, empty keyframes become the keyframes as you can see. Sorry, this become the frames. This is the keyframes and these are these are frames. Now I will animate this. I will again click on the forty keyframe. This is forty. I will press. I will press right click on my keyboard and create a keyframe. Insert the keyframe. As you can see, insert the keyframe. And between, I will select any between area of this frames. Uh, I will right click on this and I will create the motion wheel. As you can see, the motion wheel. So I will get this. I will get, I will get this bar blue because I am going to create animation inside those frames. I will select the near frames of 40, and I will select this again, and I will use one tool here, three transform tool. The transform tool is used to scale the object. I will show you. See, after selecting the three three transform tool, I got the handles around the around my text by holding this. I am going to zoom. It. I am zooming, zooming it from center. I am zooming it from center because I am holding the shift key on the keyboard. And here, there we go. We got the animation. So, how I can check this movie? I will go to play test movie. You will flash. in flash professional see 
This is the uh, small layer of the website and I shown you some tools, basic tools of the flash and I shown you the small animation like text uh, becoming small to big. This is how you can work with the flash. So again, I will again I will explain what I did. First of all, uh, the this layout inside this layer one, and in layer two we have the animation. This is my demo class. I will try. If I double click on this layer, layer two, I will I can write the layer name so that people can understand what is there in this layer. See, this is an This is how, this is the demo class and this is how you can work with the flash and I shown you what is timeline and all those things, what is tools and this is called the SFDF file which will flash generate after you test the movie. You can export this file from here also. Export. You can see export movie. You can export the things here. And if I if you save my desktop, so this is all about the flash, and this is the demo class. Hope you like my session regarding creating a small layout in the. That as well as you understood the uh, small animation and how to write the text, how to handle with rectangles, uh, how to change the colors and all those things. So I can say uh, goodbye and take care.